Having a truly world-class chef in the neighborhood would really help put your radler on the map. I've already got people like Ben Zhao putting us on the map. Yeah, well, I'm talking the world map, not the local street directory. Now, our industry needs, needs revitalizing. Imagine what someone like me could do with a space like this. Yeah, well, I'm about growing this space, but I am looking for a long-term tenant. What's your vision for this space? Diana? It says here you are quite the wonderkind. Oh, <laughs> I, don't know. I don't refer to myself as a wonderkind. I'm not that arrogant, that's more his style. But yeah, my vision. I guess family really is the key. Like, I use my Grandma June's recipes as inspo, which are the same ones that Easton grew up with. Yeah, well, when so I was So my a vision kid. really is, like, about, like, super personal, super now food porn. Think, like, pastry queen Christina Tozzi, right. banging barbecue king yeah, Francis Yeah, oh, and Marley, obviously and this is all in the context of, of a fine dining <laughs> establishment. Yeah. What, I, what I'm suggesting is us partnering up. Uh, you provide the space, we provide the talent, and we can, you know, we, we can negotiate profit share. You want free rent? Oh, no, what I want is an investor with the smarts and the brains to see what a no-brainer this is. I mean, I mean, Diana's going to be the next big thing. I'm working on the vines tomorrow. We stop for lunch at one. Bring a dessert. Done. And your business plan. Thanks for your time, Mr. Plus. It's Margot. Why do I feel like I've just been to see the headmistress? Yeah, a headmistress you want to get spanked by, I bet, you naughty boy. Don't fuck this up. <laughs> Please, miss, I've been a naughty boy.